On this episode of Make It Fabulous, we're gonna take these household items and plant flowers in them. Hmm, boring. I had a request on what I could do with flower pots. Flower pots are boring, so I'm gonna show you how to plant flowers and other things. For this project, you'll need flowers and potting soil, paint, ribbon, some chain, glitter glue, a self-adhesive stencil, and things you might have around the house to put flowers in. I'm gonna use just a tin can, some rubber rain boots, and a colander. So I'm just using an old colander that I have. Um, it looks kind of shabby chic, rustic, because you're not supposed to stick it in the dishwasher, and we did. So it's gonna make a fabulous flower pot. Which flowers do we wanna use? I chose this begonia. You can use pretty much any seasonal flower. And I'm also going to put this in the front of it so the vine will hang down below and grow around it. It's gonna look really pretty. You wanna kinda of mash up the flower into the potting soil a little bit. All right. So we're ready to hang. I'm using a rain boot because it's waterproof and it's all enclosed and so it's gonna work out perfect for our new flower pot. And I have some glitter glue. I'm just gonna put it along the seams here to clamp it up a little bit. And we have an A for Andy. So that adds a fun little sparkly touch. I use this stuff all the time, I love it. It's super easy to use. You don't end up with glitter everywhere, it's just all right there. So I'm gonna plant our Christmas cactus first. Break it apart a little bit so it fits in there. Our Sanya, which also happens to be the name for a jellyfish. Really shove it in there. So here you have it, our rain boot flower pot. For our next flower pot, we're gonna use some self-adhesive stencils. And this is my son, Bryerson. He's gonna help me put them on. Gonna peel it all off. Do you want anything else on there? You want one more? You want a Z? <laughs> okay. <laughs> this is mom. <laughs> Now that Ryerson and I have applied our stencils, I'm ready to paint. We're gonna let that dry for about 30 minutes and then we can plant our plants in it. All right, we're ready to remove the stencils. Moms, is Bryerson wanted to spell it? <laughs> Bryerson had a lot of fun helping me with this, you know, the one-on-one -on -one time of getting to create something that we're gonna use inside our house. I think that this is pretty much the perfect size, so I'm just gonna take it out and not worry about potting soil. Just stick it in, and there you have it. This one's gonna go on my windowsill. I have a chain to hang the colander out on the front porch. It's gonna look gorgeous out there. And this one I'm gonna stick upstairs in my bedroom. So here you have it, the finished products. I think they're a whole lot more fun than ordinary flower pots and have a lot more character. Hey, Mark. On this episode of Make It Fabulous, we're gonna take these household items and turn Mark. and plant flowers in them. Mark. And plant flowers in them. Mark. Okay. <clears throat> Mark. And plant flowers in them. Yeah, good. Cut. Okay. <laughs>